Today, our very own PSMO Sarcoma Specialist, Dr. Gracio Fernando Jr., just presented a comprehensive discussion on the treatment of metastatic sarcoma in an international cancer conference called ESMO Asia. For our viewers, may we ask Dr. Fernando on the highlights of metastatic sarcoma treatment, what is the importance of a multidisciplinary form of treatment, and also what is the importance of an international collaboration? Well, the answer to your first question is that the highlight is it's not curable in that situation, but you have treatment choices that you can go to. Most of the time, we would select a single agent as our first line object of choice. We can go to combinations if you have a patient that really needs to be treated and is very symptomatic, in which the getting the tumor to get smaller is going to control the symptoms. And we need to look at what type of sarcoma we're dealing with because there are some sarcomas in which a definite drug or a definite regimen is going to be indicated rather than the standard doxorubicin or iphosphamide combination that we're used to. What is the importance of an international collaboration? You know, the problem is I've been to a sarcoma, international sarcoma conference, and the one thing I learned is that we in the Philippines, we are way, way behind as far as sarcoma treatment is concerned. There are many things these people can teach us about understanding not just how to treat this, but the very nature and biology of these tumors. So I think it behooves that we get in touch with these people and learn because really the things that they're doing about next generation sequencing, microRNA determination, even whole genome sequencing, if we have the materials, I think we not only can duplicate this research, we can create research of our own. Finally, multidisciplinary. By far, in the treatment of sarcoma, the management always has to be multidisciplinary. Even in a metastatic setting, there has to be room for, let's say, surgery or radiotherapy to come in, even in a palliative situation, because there are times when you're going to have to resect a lesion if that lesion requires resection, because that is the symptomatic uh, answer to the treatment of that patient. This is not just a medical oncology problem. Every specialty in oncology has an important role to play as far as sarcoma treatment is concerned. Thank you very much, sir, and congratulations on your um, comprehensive discussion earlier. Thank you.